Hey friends, welcome back to Bitfumes. I'm your host Sarthak and you can also call me Angur. Firstly, I want to congratulate you to going so far with me and I think you have done tremendously well job and thanks for your support because of that encouraged me to make awesome videos on Laravel and now we're finally on the crud operation and this is also requested by mashad zayed mashad you rock the comment section na? okay so we finally on the crud operation and in this episode we are going to learn create operation of the crud as you know that crud means create read update and delete or destroy whatever you want to say okay so in this episode we are going to complete the create section of the crud operation for that i will just go to my view in the resource folder and in the to do list you see that we have actually created the crud operation create operation in our mini project part 13 of my level 5.4 series so we will just going to enhance that system so i will just start my server by going to command prompt cd php artisan serve and again for other work okay just minimize it go to our server and yes there is an error because we don't have a welcome page so slash to do and we know that items we have added and there is add new section here we have created actually the create part of crud so let's see where it is we have to open the to do controller so in this to do controller you can see that we have completed the create section in in the create section we will redirect to the store part where we store everything actually not everything we just only have a body section so we have actually completed but we will enhance this system so i want this a body with a title also so i will just add a title section so for that i will go to create dot blade dot php and in the form section here i will say mm, this i will just copy and paste this and here i will delete this for this i will say input type is text name is title class is form control okay let's see refresh and yes you have the title just give a placeholder placeholder title okay let's see yes this is the title and here also placeholder placeholder body let's see yeah this is completed so when i type here this is new title and body is rubbish submit and you will see this is submitted but this is the only body submitted but we don't have any title section here to add the title section here i have to modify my table also here in this database you can see that in the to do's table i only have a body section and no title section what we can do that we can just go to structure section and we can add a field but this is not the laravel way i will just show you laravel way of doing this so for that just go to your database folder and in that database folder you will see migration and there is the migration and here you will just type another field title as a string and to make changes we have to run a command called php artisan migrate refresh let's see the result and it deleted the table and recreated it let's go to our database and let's see the result in the structure part you have seen the title is also added but our data is also lost so don't worry for that we will create that data so just give it a refresh and you will see nothing because we don't have anything so we have to add this section in our create part let's close this and this also and go to our controller here in the store part i will just validate the title also so we required the title also so title and let's see the result refresh and body is written title is nothing click submit and yeah the title field is required so we have validate the title so now just save that title 
so to do title is request title okay and here what i will do i will just make unique title not the body body can be anything but title must be unique in our new case so we have everything set now we have this is new title this is new body submit and yes this is new body because we have shown here only body what we can do that we can go to our home dot blade dot php instead of body i can type here title and give it refresh this is new title okay and as we know that t is small in the accessor part we just go to our model in the app folder this is a to do model and we can change this to do title and give it a refresh and yeah you can see that t is capitalized because of the accessor we have learned in the i think part 14 and you can do same thing in the mutator also instead of body you can just type title and here also you have to type title and then go to the home page and add new and i will say title 2 this is another body and hit submit and you can see that this is new title and in this case the t is capitalized and you can just check by uncommenting the accessor and refresh so first is not capitalized second is capitalized because we have placed a mutator which change the field so it will just submitted that title with the capital t so we does not need an accessor okay just check this access so that everything will be capitalized okay so we have done the create part i think you have to go to the part 13 to, to check the whole process of creating the create part of the crud so if you have any doubt in this episode please feel free to comment me the next episode we will talk about the read section of this crud operation you can follow me on facebook twitter and instagram and please subscribe to my channel for the new updates of laravel and the cool thing about the laravels and if you have any doubt if you want to learn anything new just feel free to comment me i will make a video for you like mashad he has requested me a lot of things and thank you man thank you very much for your support and please share this video with your developer friends and till then we will meet in the next episode bye